the whistle of Jonathan Lardo. A Celtic try to football. Much of the heavy lifting already done by the Scottish champions in this tie. Here to Iceland. Former Motherwell man. It's Pablo Punez's pass, and now Finson trying to steady himself, and just like that, Stewart will take the lead. Defence has opened up the trees to play against. Boyata's recovery run isn't good enough. Look at him jogging back into position. He's going to be back in quicker. Cross comes near and beats on. He's going to make it better tackle as well. So, from a defensive point of view, it's an absolute disaster. From a confidence point of view, Sean Amo grow in confidence totally against the run of play. Celtic has started better. Now it's game on. Now is a real challenge, a real mental challenge for Celtic to try and get itself in this game. Of course, they just need a goal, but that wasn't the script. Pulley had started that. It was carried on by Jeppe Hansen. But James Forrest, who took his place last week, at the last minute as well, because of the Mackay Seaman injury. However, you know, it's not going to smooth there. Or all the way, Celtic would have liked it to win. Punyad trying to bust her again. An inquiry about possible handball, but the referee is having none of it. 26 year old Dane. It's good play again, you know, it's good play by Finson as well. Good quick feet, moving the ball around. I think that was the handball shot. I'm not too sure it was a handball. If it was, yeah, it certainly, you know, it certainly hit the arm of Boyata, but. He was representing El Salvador, actually born in Miami, but. It's a Salvadoran international. A little bit exposed, but. This is the opportunity. Chief G tries a little back heel. They get a clear guy, Mackay Stevens. Certainly, you know, on the surface and the obstacles they have to overcome. I think it's been a good first half performance by Celtic. There's Punied. First Salvador and ever to play in a Champions League fixture of any description. Finson. Wrong side of the post. That will disappoint Jana. Oh, now, Boyata. Just outside the penalty area. Punied. It's the player who hit the surface uh, need at least a couple of goals. And now they try to knock it on. It's John Ann and the shot does come in. Now well, Laxdal. That will disappoint Ronnie Dyer. You know the easy game. Somebody's got to go and make a challenge. Van Dyke stands off from Scott Brown. I think Good Johnson is. Just trying to draw a free kick, trying to get Stephen Johansson booked, but nothing in it at all. It's almost there for Gunnarsson. Van Dyke, he to step ahead. Now, chase back for FA Ambrose. Seems right and left. Wouldn't be very unpredictable. There's nothing orthodox about it. He's been coming into the Celtic side. You know, he's been at the heart of a lot of things, particularly in the second half. It's on. Not about working something with Rogic. Oh, that's an interesting approach. For